need of the road issue, Jeff. I'm questioning the proposal to create a new tax, a brand new tax, in order to pay for something. How do you reconcile that as a guy who is, has came into office as a fiscal conservative, a fiscal hawk? Well, I reconcile that as saying that I've tried, and the mayor has, tried to cut a significant part of our budget. We've tried to reallocate millions and millions of dollars. And if anything, this is bringing this to light because this issue has taken off. And people are now talking and saying, what are the solutions? And to, my, to, to people who say, I don't like that idea, I say, what's your solution? Because I'm not hearing a lot of solutions. I would look at other options. We have a two-cent BBB tax. I would look at putting that back out to the voters and saying, do we reduce that down for a couple years while we institute a one-cent transportation tax, something that's more neutral? I'm willing to look at all kinds of ideas, but the roads have got to get fixed. I'm confident that we could, if there was a political will, cut and reallocate significantly at City Hall, but I don't see the will. So part of what I'm doing is bringing awareness to this issue and trying to motivate people to start talking to your council members, start going down there. People should be, people should be upset that their roads are in this kind of condition and that for years we've been involved in all kinds of projects around the city that have diverted the funds that have gotten to us. This didn't happen overnight. I was just reading the other day uh, an article from the Daily Sun from 2009, and um, it was, I believe it was Councilman Joe Howie who was arguing, why are we in the housing business? Can we change the way we do the sustainability project? Hey, hey, Jeff, Jeff, let me jump in on that because